Hello aspirants, welcome back to the College Review Series by Akash, our platform where you get 360 degree review of various engineering colleges. So today it's time for an Indian Institute of Technology which is situated in the smart city of India, Indore. Yes, I'm talking about IIT Indore. And to know everything about this IIT, about its campus, courses, fee structure, placements and a lot more, then stay with me till the end. Indian Institute of Technology Indore, also known as IIT Indore or IITI, was established by the Government of India in 2009. It is one of the eight newly established IITs. According to NIRF 2024, the IIT has been ranked 16 in the engineering category, 8th by the QS World University ranking and 76th by the Asia University ranking. Let's have a look at its wonderful campus. The campus is spread over an area of 502 acres which is 25 kilometers from the city of Indore. IIT Indore campus is fully residential where students from all academic programs live on campus. The campus provides all the basic facilities such as hostels. Currently there are six hostels and accommodation is provided on sharing basis. Then 24 hours high speed internet facility, indoor sports facilities, common room facility, laundry facility, plus there is a bank, post office, utility store, eateries, dining hall and salon in the close vicinity. Talking about the academic programs here at IIT Indore, then the IIT offers a wide range of undergraduate and postgraduate programs where the Bachelor of Technology programs come with a provision of converting B.Tech program to M.Tech program at the end of fifth semester. So the programs that come under B.Tech degree are Chemical Engineering, Civil Engineering, Computer Science and Engineering, Electrical Engineering, Engineering Physics, Mathematics and Computing, Mechanical Engineering, Metallurgical Engineering and Material Science, Space Sciences and Engineering. And to get admission in one of these courses, admission process and eligibility criteria is same at all the IITs. As the students first of all need to pass class 12 board examination with physics, chemistry and mathematics as their core subject. For general category, the required aggregate is 75% and for categories such as ST, SC or PWD, the required aggregate is 65%. Further, the students need to clear J advance to be eligible for admission process. And to be eligible for that, you need to first pass J main paper 1. For foreign nationals, they can register themselves straight away for J advance. They need not to clear J main. Alright, thereafter, you register yourself for JOSA counseling based on the mark secured in J advance. Further, the selected students need to verify their documents and pay the required fees. For foreign students, Foreign students are accepted through DASA, Direct Admission of Students Abroad and ICCR schemes. Now let's talk about the fee structure. Then the tuition fee at all the IIT is same which is 1 lakh. Hence the total fee per semester which includes tuition fee, group insurance premium, registration fee, one-time admission fee, refundable security deposits, accommodation and other facilities, mess advance fee is going to be 1,59,550 per semester for general category of candidates. Therefore, 4 years of BTEC from IIT Indore will amount to be between 12 to 13 lakh. With this, the IIT also offers certain fee waivers to its economically weaker section students like 100% tuition fee remission to all the SC, ST or PWD candidates, full remission of tuition fee to all the candidates whose parental income is less than 1 lakh. The IIT also provides interest-free loans to the students whose parental income is between 5 lakh to 9 lakh. In addition, there are certain scholarship schemes provided to all the meritorious and economically weaker section students. The scholarships such as Central Sector Scholarship to SC students from the Ministry of Social Justice and Empowerment and to ST students from the Ministry of Tribal Affairs of Government of India. Scholarships from different states, scholarships instituted by various private trusts also. And to get in-depth knowledge of all these scholarships and more, do visit the link given in the description. Talking about the placements now. 
So the placement statistics at IIT Indore have been strong with students securing positions in top companies both in India and globally. As the placement statistics for the session 2024-25 have not yet been disclosed by the institute, so we are going to rely on the available data which is for the session 2022-23. So the highest CTC drawn was 68 LPA from Computer Science and Engineering branch and the average CTC stood at 25.45 LPA. Here is the branch wise placement percentage. The infographic shows the percent of students placed against the students registered in different branches in the year 22-23. The top recruiters of IIT Indoor placements in 2023 included Amazon, Microsoft, Flipkart, Samsung, Oracle, Goldman Sachs and many more. Talking about events and fest here at IIT Indoor, then the IIT offers a vibrant student life with various clubs, cultural activities and technical events. The events conducted here are Fluxus which is IIT Indoor's annual techno cultural fest. MUN IIT Indore is an annual Model United Nations conference hosted by IIT Indore that brings together students from various backgrounds to stimulate UN committees, discuss global issues and diplomatic and leadership skills. eCell Meetup is all about how other eCells are working and promote startup culture in their campuses. Netrip is a student leadership conclave which gives student leaders across Indore a common forum to discuss matters related to student welfare and plan collaborative cultural, technical and social events. Heuristica is an annual coding festival of IIT Indore. TEDx IIT Indore which is an annual event with a plethora of knowledge planting seeds of ideas and inspiring young minds plus international relations and collaborations yes IIT Indore faculty and students have been collaborating with countries worldwide since its inception most notable among these are Germany and France now let's have a look at the J Advance rank cutoff 2024 so you get an idea how much rank you need to secure and how much hard work you still need to do in order to make it here at IIT Indore. Here is the branch wise cutoff after fifth round of JOSA counseling. For chemical engineering, the rank cutoff for this branch opened for gender neuter at 7,109 and closed at 7,913. For civil engineering, the opening rank stood at 8,296 and the closing rank was 9,773. For computer science and engineering branch, the rank went as high as 823 and the rank closed at 1,389. Talking about electrical engineering, the opening rank for gender neuter was 2,359 and the closing rank was 3,818. Here is the branch wise cutoff for all the remaining branches. You can pause the video or take a screenshot. For more information on IIT Indore cutoff 2024 or for category wise information, do visit the link given in the description. Alright, so if you are considering IIT Indore for your 4 years of BTEC program, then let me tell you the IIT has a huge score for its CSE and ECE branch students. Whereas if you compare IIT Indore with the top IITs of the nation, then it would not make much sense. Rather, it would be reasonable to compare IIT Indore with the top NITs of the nation like NIT Warangal and NIT Trichy, keeping various factors such as placements and opportunities in mind. Rest, getting a job in a reputed company and drawing a high package should not be your only concern at this point of time. In fact, your ultimate goal should be gaining knowledge, acquiring skills, exploring various areas such as entrepreneurship, startup, coding, marketing, along with nurturing a sportsman in you by taking parts in various sports events, plus maintaining a decent CGPA as well. Now, how you are going to do is all up to you as this was all from me today. Now, you let me know which other IIT or other college do you want me to review next. Don't forget to press the like and subscribe button so you do not miss out on any updates. For more such informative content, stay connected.